know that your girl Earl from a Breeze and Reborn. And I'm going to go through a few of my things for my smart girl. Um, and I will name the shops as I open the things up. But I did this video prior to. So that's why you see some of the packages are open. But... I'm missing a race a lot of the stuff off my phone by mistake. So this is going to be a quick run through because I really don't want this video to be too long. Some of the shops, I know the name. Some, I don't know if we got a card or something in the pack. I'll show it. If not, we're going to move right along because like I said, I don't want this video to be terribly long. And I'm trying to do this real quick in a hurry before my family name gets back. <laughs> now, this one here was done, um, can package in this package right here. And this came from Summer Dippity. Let me see. Yeah. And this is... Oh, that's my receipt in there. Oh, yeah. This is the name of the shop. Let me let that focus. This shop can be found on Etsy. So if you're interested, that's the name of the shop. Because some of these things, I, I'm not going back and link it underneath. So I'll spell it out. Because it's going to be too many. For me to name. Everything can package like this. And matter of fact, I can put this on her right now. And this is her little necklace that I purchased for her. How did this go? Oh, okay, I see. Did it go that way? Oh, watch. Oh, goodness, how did this go? Wait a minute. Let me figure this out real quick. Oh, no. I think you just pull the chain through. That's what it is. I think that's how that goes. Oop, yeah. Well, early. <laughs> Maybe I should have practiced this before I came on camera, shaming myself and the devil. <laughs> okay. Oops. Yeah, that's just how it goes. It loops through. Hold on, if I got to get down the loop. There it goes. Loops through like that. And that's her necklace. I'm pop her head off. And the wig. So I can get that on her. Don't fret. I will put it back. Her necklace. I mean, her thing. And that's her little necklace right there. And you can adjust it to whatever length that you want it to. Put her head back on. And that's the only thing when you put things on like this here. You do have to pop the head off so everybody don't get in a panic. Oh, I probably I mess up her wig. Eileen, don't have a baby. We'll get it back on you. Have you looking sharp in just a sec. Yep, and this other one is her bracelet and it can package like that. And I'll come up close because it's her name, Eileen. So that's her bracelet. Oops, I didn't want to knock your wig off of her. And see, one thing I like about that wig, it don't fit tight, so I can easily pop it off or pop it back on. And, then, and if you like this wig, this is by ubidolls.com. She got that pink wig from. But anyway, that's her. Hold up this. Show off your little bracelet. And that came 
from that shelf that I showed you guys earlier. Now, what happened to that package? Because I'm going to keep up with these little pieces. they get away from you. Now, what's this? Okay, now, this shelf is from Beautifully Custom. And it comes in... It comes in a plastic bag, and then you got another plastic bag inside. And everything comes... Oops. These are the... The the Econ Brown Half Open Size Eyes for the Smart Doll. Let me see. She also has some gray eyes, but I wanted her some brown ones, too. That's that one. And then I got this tool here, which it actually matches my, um, actually my set that I cut here with is the same color with the purple and all the colors. And that's from these, this is the card right here, Beautifully Custom. And this is her contact information right here. Not only does she sell eyes for the smart dolls, and like I said, that's that tool is to take the eyes um, in and out, and for you to you know press on the putty around the eyes to help you put the eyes in. And that's some beautifully custom. If I'm going too fast, to just pause the video, and then that way you can. Um, See, see the name of the shelf if I'm going too fast. Now, this um, package here came like this in this color envelope. And it's from by Star Dreamer Studios. And it comes in this box. And hold up, she got a card in here. I'm glad they put these cards because I sure. Don't have time. Like I see the link all in this from Star Dreaming Studio. That's her Instagram, her Facebook information. And this is another card right here. And like I said, we did, me and my nieces did all these videos. Well, some of them can't just came in the mail during the holidays, but we did a lot of videos. Okay. These are her Mickey ears. That's the red and black one. And this one here kind of matched the outfit she got on now. Let's see. Oh, goodness. Am I messing up your wig? <laughs> oh, that is so cute. Look at this. And that's her Mickey ears. With that one. So if you're looking for ears for your smart doll. And also a lot of people too use the... Um, the Christmas tree ornament for the smart doll for the ears as well, the Mickey ears. And I shouldn't have put those ears on because with the same outfit she got on, I had had her made this hat to go with it. So now, oh goodness, let me pull this wig off. Wait a minute, let me see, pull the ears off. And I don't know if we can fit over all this here. All right, there you go. I had her a pink hat made. Totally forgot about that. See, that's why I said I don't even know what I ordered with these things. You know, I'd be doing the most. And you don't have to get this color ears. You can. She got a, a list of colors that you can customize the ear. What color you want the hairband and what color you want the ear. But like I always tell y'all, mint green and pink is my favorite. She got a lot of that in her collection. And... We got the red and black for a specific reason, too. I will show y'all that in a second. I hope it's up here close to me. Yes. Now, this particular set of clue, um, package I'm about to open up, this one came from Angel Marie Boutique. And hold up, she got cards in here too. And it comes packaged like this in the clear plastic. And these are her <coughs> card information. Let 
See, I come on here because I like to share with everybody. Um, so don't make it difficult. And I think I see this card in here too. I hope this card didn't come out from something else, but anyway. But I had and it came like this. And I had these shirts custom made for my doll. Because I thought I would have had her here a little bit earlier than I did. But like I said, with everything going on with Dad, that kind of delayed me getting her. But this was her breast cancer awareness shirt. And it says, Hope. I just... This is her Chanel shirt. And as you can see, it's the sparkly Chanel. This is her black and pink Louis Vuitton shirt. And the pink got the hearts on it. And everybody know I do DoorDash. And y'all play with it. She got her DoorDash shirt and her DoorDash um, low bag. So she can go dashing with me. Because I was asking Ambrosia Dollhouse who I can get to meet me a uh, DoorDash shirt. And, um, and she told me a couple of people. And I went to both of them. But once she was, she cut to do it. But she never responded back to me as to how much, you know, and nothing. And I came across this young lady, Peach, and I asked her, and she was like, sure. As a matter of fact, she is making me two more things right now as we speak. And this, when I told you I ordered this, these, this here, that's to go to her Mickey shirt. Because so see, Mickey got the sparkling black ears. And this is her Gucci shirt. And that is the sparkling hairband for her to wear to match the mini mouse ears on her Gucci shirt. So I wanted to share that with you guys. That's that's why I ordered the black and the red ears just to go to that shirt that I had specially made for her. So these were all front. And this lady did a lovely job. And the thing that's easy to put on her shirt. They Velcro right down the back. So it ain't gonna be nothing difficult to put on and off. And I believe Dee Dee House of Dolls, she has um, one of the Chanel shirts from her as well. right along now this package came from Renee I don't hopefully she got a shop name in here hold up you say thank you there's a thank you card came in here and it says to open oh but she got the card sealed hold on give me a second to unseal it She got all the sides taped up. All with the cutest little stickers come inside. Hold up. Oh, wait a minute. Let me take this tape off the top. Oh, that's cute. And I don't want to drop the little stickers. And it says, thank you much for your support, for supporting my shop. And it says, Spoomsy, S-P-O-O-M-S-Y. But... Let me see what's the and she has the cute little stickers on the outside of the bag as well with the owls. And I don't remember what I ordered from this shop. So okay, these ones I haven't opened yet. And they come packaged like this. 
Maybe after I see the item, I can tell you where I purchased them from. Oh, I will list, um, link this down below. I don't remember the name of the shop right offhand. This is an Etsy shop, but I'll put SpongeBob pajamas and I'll tell you exactly where it was at, where I got it from. Dee Dee got the tank top set and I got the long sleeve set. And that's the um, SpongeBob top with the little SpongeBob bottoms, panty bottoms. Maybe the shop name is Spoonies. Because they say S P O O N. Is it N Y or N Y? I can't even see because it's so tiny. And then it has the matching thigh high socks with the low bowls in the front to go with it. Now, I did ask her to, um, you know, if she had more material because it was just the pajamas. And I asked her if she had more material left because she made me the thigh high stockings. And I'll pay the difference because. I do like when they have the thigh highs to go with the PJs. So this is one of her pajamas. And as a matter of fact, she had a rainbow stripe set with the socks that I want to get as well. Not pajamas, but a, sw a sweatshirt and the matching socks. And then I think somebody else had the jacket that can match that as well. But anyway, y'all check out the shop. Because like I say, I will... The ones that I don't name or don't have a card to show right up front, I will sh um, share their links down below. So I will put the link down below for this one here. And check this out. <laughs> this one here got her apron, which I thought this was so pretty. Because I got aprons too. When I, I put aprons on when I be reborn in my dolls as well. I got aprons like when I cook and stuff. And I thought this was the cutest. She can be in her little pink apron because my patient, um, Miss Faye, Faye used to eat in her different aprons. And she had a beautiful one with cupcakes and things like that on it and it was pink. And I told her husband, and look at the back. And I told her husband, if anything ever happened to Faye, can I have one of those things? And he must have told his daughter, he said, no, we ain't going to wait till something happened to Faye. We want you to enjoy it now. And it has the matching cook make to go with it isn't that the cutest and these mix are like quilted like you see and this is and look at the, the cutest little detail in the front as well as in the back of this apron isn't that pretty so that's that and like i said i will link the name of this shop it just escaped me right now but i will link that information down below and this is absolutely beautiful. You know, like I said, everything from every sh vendor, every shop, I absolutely love for this smart doll. I have yet to have been disappointed with anything that I purchased for her. Let me pause y'all one second. Let me get the rest. Okay. We're back. And like I said, a lot of these things were things that me and my niece named did videos. And I, Kennedy and Maddie, I do apologize that I, um, missing the race, y'all, videos. Okay. Oh, no, that one I already done. Let me pass my own did. What is that? Okay. I purchased these from Todd Thornton on Facebook. And it came, came an envelope like this, same package like this. And these are some Elite Doll pieces. And it's the black and white leggings. And then it was this um, long sleeve cardigan with the pockets. And I like that. So she got that jacket too. And as y'all saw in that lead haul, I got plenty shirts that can go with that. But I had ordered those two from him. He had other things for sale, but fast as anything be out for sale on Facebook, it goes pretty fast.
And this one is from Tia and Tool for Russia. It comes packaged like that. And yeah, it was in this orange paper. Like I said, it had thank you on it. But we did this video prior to, and it came like this here. And this shop is on Etsy. And this is the name of the shop on Etsy. And these are this um I don't know, they call this a leather or a suede. It's almost like a suede. Um you know, you feel like leather on the inside, but it's like a Swedish brush feel on the outside. And you have the leather belt to go with it. And these were the, the Coulard shots. But, and it was in like a dusty rose color, mauve color. And that's why I purchased these. Because y'all know anything in the pink family's tone. And I figured she could have wear it with tights and some boots. Or some pair of booties. Because I do like her little booties on her. And she had this t-shirt on with a um, denim skirt on her site. And she was advertising a denim skirt. And I'm like, well, the skirt is nice, but I'm really interested in the little... Um, and I forget what my niece say this doll is from. But um, I told her I was interested in the little t-shirt that she had on with the skirt. And she said, well, that was the last one. But I purchased this t-shirt here with this little doll on it. I thought that was cute. And I'm going kind of fast because, like I said, don't know how much space I have on my phone. But I wanted, because I said I was going to do, I, I had all these th things done individually so I could link each shop individually underneath each video to give everybody different shops and options to buy things for their smart doll. But right now, I'm just running through kind of fast. And like I said, they're on Etsy. I hope I, I probably didn't drop this out. The, I sure we did this. I fell out in the bag. Oh, that came from Denise. I think mean, that was when she said her eyes because I, I kept everything in the perspective bag. Now, this one here, and I don't know how the, I don't know, is Attica doll? But anyway, well, I didn't know they was based out in New Jersey, in Jersey City. Um, it comes packaged like this. The name of their shop is on their package. And <laughs> that's, oh Lord, it's such a glare. That's the name of the shop. Let me take the package out. And it comes beautifully packaged. And this is one of those two-piece sets. Some of the way she got on a booty shorts. Once again, pink and white. That's the back with the ribbon tie in the back. And that's the long sleeve top. And you got the little peekaboo across the breast. And I, yeah, it just slips on. But a nice scratchy material, so it'll be easy on, easy off. And that's from that. And you can Google this shop, and it's spelled A-D-Y-K-A. And these outfits are very inexpensive. I, if I'm not mistaken, I think they're under $20, if I'm not mistaken. That one. Now, this particular shop here, this is from Doll Delight. my receipt this is the name of it this is the um the page for that one 
that sort of uh, thing. And when I tell you they got some risky um, sexy clothes like this, y'all. Woo, do. And even if your smart dog got the large boobs, oh, goodness, they, they got it there. And this is her um, Minnie Mouse PJs. And it's gray with the gold foil. So she'll put this on one PJ Saturday. I'm a full one, y'all. Now, y'all probably can see most of my dolls that reborns on this channel. I, I do like my reborns still, but I really, really enjoy shopping for this girl. I enjoy dressing her. Um, She like a little mini me. The same things that... Girl, listen. Sam, I'll, I can show y'all some pictures of me back in the day. Same thing y'all see on this doll is things I used to wear myself. And I, and I tell y'all, I love, love, love my stiletto. But since I had the foot surgery, and I had, like I said, I got screws in my feet right now. It makes it um, sometimes almost impossible to wear. But I know for a fact... <laughs> Wait, let me tell you, well, that got a lot of them here at this house. Because as a matter of fact, my sister and Anna keeps saying, Earl, you need to carry those Gucci heels pumps and put it in the, um, the Simon stove. Um, this is from Mysterious Doll World. And this came from overseas from Lithuania, Lithuania, or whatever. That's, that's where it comes from. And the name of her shop is spelled. Oh, this one I already did before. Because I, um, Shonda got the skirt, and that's the lace top. I, I, I already did the show this one before. I'm sorry. That one I already showed in a prior video. Let's take all my smart dog things in one bag so I can keep up with this stuff. Um, and this one came from Maya's Nook. And she got a thing on here. Thank you for your su for supporting my biz small business sticker on the front. I'm gonna put my name over her name. A little sticker right there. It came in this blue envelope. Oh, now see when I showed y'all that now I'm looking at this, I don't even think it matches. I bought those gold so socks from Elite Doll, thinking it goes with this gold shirt, but it, it does not. But um, her shop is on eBay, and it's these pretty plaid sh um, shorts, and it has the gold in the plaid, the gold lines, and she paired it with this gold shirt off the shoulder, and that's why I thought the gold thigh highs that I ordered from, think the mustard thigh highs would have matched this here, because I told y'all I had a plaid short set. She's an eBay vendor. And I will try to go back and find this one, the vendor to this, and look, um, put this below. So that's two of them I got to put below. Right, so far, I think. Okay. Look. Nope. Sophie Toy Paradise. I'm not sure if I've shown this before or not. But these are her sparkly silver shoes. Remember the um the silver, the gray and pink jogger set that I bought from Elite Doll? I bought these sparkly tennis to go with that. And that's why I was telling y'all I'm not sure if it matches, you know, if it would look good now. And not, it does match her silver jewelry, though. <laughs> put your little bracelet so your little name can show. Then I put the bracelet on upside down. Now, you yeah. know. And that come from Sophie Doll Paradise on, um, Sophia's, Sophie, S-O-P-H-I-E, Toy, T-O-Y, Paradise, on Etsy.com. That's what those shoes there came from. Okay. Now this, I thought this was so beautifully packaged. Um, this from 
nerdy chick doll and hers had the stickers all over and I actually first saw this on um, Facebook but then she got a shop on Etsy and she got a card so let me show y'all her card and that's the information right there and for anybody else who got smart dolls if you found something from a shop that I didn't name in this video y'all share it with me and share it with others in the community because we all in this I mean I know a lot of people say they don't like people to dig dolls dress like nobody but to still make more than one let's be realistic and we all love these dolls I mean they don't have to buy every piece you got but and y'all could, I mean, people should have common sense not to get everything identical. But you could purchase some things um, that I, I don't mind sharing. Because I feel I can't prosper if um, God don't give me the knowledge to find these stores. And I share it with other people. Because when I was getting into the community, people shared some of the shops with me. Not all, but some of them. So I share with other people. And she said, thank you for your um, purchase. I included a pink sash if you wanted to change the look. Oh, now that is so cute. Because everybody know pink is my favorite color. She don't know, but... And it came in this beautiful purple bag. And I know it's another name that begins with a Y, but I... But for the sake of this video, we just call this a robe today. But, um... Oh, God, you know these little Chinese robe things here. But I liked it, the one that has Sailor Moon on it. Even though I know, she, I believe Sailor Moon is a Vogue doll, if I'm not mistaken. But anyway, that's the one that I purchased for her. Because I thought that was so pretty. And they look almost like the smart dolls as well. But, um, and then she even put the Sailor Moon ribbon to tie around as the belt. To go with that. And I thought that was really, really neat. And then she said she put this pink sash in here. Which you can use a pink belt around it as well. And, oh, oh goodness. I got stickers falling all over the place. And she gave me a lot of little stickers. The um, stars and, oh, the little thing that Sailor Moon holds and the Sailor Moon little stickers. But this is one doll that I was looking for too now. I do want Sailor Moon. Because I, I, I do like her doll. But every time I would go on there, they say sold out. So I don't know if it's something that been in production or what. But maybe something will come up on the second market for me. But um, there's a lady that um here on youtube and if i'm not mistaken i think her name possibly might be sailor moon but when i tell you everything is sailor moon for her she got everything must be come out with sailor moon i want to i mean really really some really nice thing that's all i found out about sailor moon looking at her channel she and if you didn't like sailor moon you'll fall in love with it by the time you finish looking at her channel but anyway that's from nerdy chick dolls she did an awesome job with these Oh, God, I can't think of the name for these little... Uh, uh, it's another name for them than a robe. But I just say robe, but it's, that's not the correct terminology for this here. I, I it just... I told y'all, scratch for me brings on seizures, and seizures for me gives me short-term memory loss, and I just can't remember. Now, this is from Mo Benjo, and those, um... Oh, God. I always want to say Ewok, but it ain't Ewok. What a great thing I just get. Wait a minute. Get right here. I don't know if I can find half of the pajamas right now. Well, anyway. The pajamas she had that said nap time on... In some previous videos, that also came from Mo Benjo. And that's M-O-B-I-N-G-O. -O, right on Etsy. Oh, here it is. Thank you. Oh, I appreciate everybody for putting their cards. The ones who had cards. And, um. 
in the video so then that way we can move right along And these, that's, I think these might have been the first things I ever ordered for my smart dog because Ambrosia Dollhouse told me about this show. And she was one of the ones I had asked about doing the shirt for me for the DoorDash. But like I said, I never heard back from her. And when I bought this, I was thinking it would have matched those pink leggings that i had got from um elite doll but the the leggings are soft pink like this and not this color paint it just don't match it don't look good together to me but i bought that from her the little crop top i thought that was cute the little tie dye with the strawberries and y'all know once it was pink i was sold But this shop, not only does she sell clothes for the smart doll, she sell clothes, I believe, for the mini fee. One, the little miniature ones, too. It's smaller dolls as well. So I think it's one third and is it one fourth size, I believe? Either one fourth or one sixth to one of them. And, and that's how they come packaged. And I got these holographic <laughs> sexy pants for her leggings. Which I think are so sexy. And Doll Delight got the shoes I want to get to go with this. But they actually went up on those shoes. Because those shoes ain't used to be priced at. But then I went up on the shoes. If I find the shoes a little bit. But I've been looking at them shoes for the longest. And then when I finally got m my money to go get the shoes, they were sold out. Now they brought the shoes back and I went up on the price for the New Year's. So, here we go again. With that. And like I see this one here was from uh, Mo Benjo. With these ones. And I showed y'all the cord and shoes that I got the other day. So I did that one. No, I didn't. Did I? No, I didn't. I did not do this. I don't think I did. Because I thought I still had the video with my sister um, on it. Well, you and this is from Sucha, and that's S U E C H A on Smart. I mean on Etsy, and this is her fur coat. See, she then she say Santa baby put a sable under the tree for me, and this is all and this her fur boot covers. To match it like what she got on now put those on like if she had on low quarter boots those will cover up and you just see the peekaboo because i at the time she just had the smart dog boots when i had originally ordered this and so i said well let me get the smart put the, get if she can make i asked her about making me some boot covers to match but later on i ended up finding these boots here which has the which is the same color as the coat and the fur To match the um, thing. So technically I don't need the boot covers again. But like if she wear a mini skirt with this coat. Then she can wear the boot covers. But she got boots to go with her jeans. All leggings that matches her coat. And I did get a clip. I didn't. Um, so like I said I thought I still had the other video. So I will show that clip. I'll attach it to this video here. And. Y'all can see this, these things up close and personal. There was another thing from this shop thing. I forget, sure enough, I did not show this video. 
But I'll see if I can try to get it attached to me. So I will like, well, that other outfit. Oh, goodness. And that was her red coat. And this, this coat here, because I got this coat, the pink one, which I think I showed in the pr previous video, to go with the boots she got on now, the pink and the white fur boots. And this is the pink and white fur coat to match. Okay, from Sucha is another outfit. Hold up. Because I put my... This is something I had got for Canela. And I stuck it in this bag so I wouldn't lose it. But I, the good thing I did because I've been looking up and down for it. This was a um, low fur unicorn low fur <laughs> sleeper with the low berry shoes to go with it with the low unicorn ears. And I believe this came from AliExpress, I believe. But I'll hold that to the side because I had it in the same bag with this outfit. But like I said, I, I was I forgot that this too came from the suture and it comes with the name on the bag. Shoes I bought separately. But it's this beautiful skirt with the tulips. Absolutely pretty. And like I said, I'll show this here close up. On a clip under, and it's the sheer um, tie in the front shirt with the ruffles go around the neckline. And these are with the mauve rose stilettos that I got to go with that. I don't know if you can see these shoes. These are stilettos to go with that, to go with this outfit. Those are the heels. That I purchased and they black and they have the mauve and pink tone roses on them. And I swear I got some black shoes, some shape identical to this one. They mine got black stud spikes all over it. I had wore those to, uh, um, I think they were Steve Madden's. I had wore those to um, a motorcycle um, party or something. Club party. <sighs> as soon as I get out the truck, I've been on the ground in them years. Oh, glory. That goes back. But those were the two sets I got from the Sutra. Store. And like I said, that shop is on Etsy.com. We still moving right along. Now this, did I already show this? Yeah, that's the one I already showed. Something falling back down in the bag, y'all. So forgive me. Okay, I'm not sure where this come from. But I'm almost certain when this box is, is something for the smart doll, I'm hoping. Because I never even opened this one up. Oh, goodness help me. I need something to open this. Oh, glory. Oh, oh hold on. I need to see something. I need to see any money down to find that house with that fast. I got it right here. Okay. Remember I told y'all I got this smart doll set here from um, um, Elite Doll. And it's black with the gold plaid. And you got the um, oh goodness. This top here to go with it. These are as well as the scarf and the crossover top to go with that long sleeve top these were the shoes oh they give me something they give me a free gift in there oh, what is that oh a mirror book 
What? Hold on. Let me go go get. Oh no, this is her tablet. Oh, this is her tablet I ordered. I forgot. Oh yeah, her little tablet. That's what it is. The little tablet. Oh, look at your little computer you're going to be typing on. I did not know this was even in that box. Okay, that's good to know. But these were her booty shoes that I Mac bought to go with this outfit. And see? Boom. These little booties I bought to go with that. And that's to go with that outfit. As well as she can wear it with the other mustard short pants set that I just showed as well. Okay, now let's put this back. And like I say, maybe if I can do some twindies with some of the sisters in the community who Got the same outfit. Oh, no, this one, this one. And I'm, uh, you know, like I say, I'll be changing her and doing more pictures of her on Facebook. So follow me on Facebook. Sometimes I'll come on and do videos and doing changing videos but and a good thing like i said with her with elite doll clothes they just slide on the slide also again i don't have to pull her completely apart but sometimes clothes are so fitting you do have to pull the doll apart to um to do the videos for those who are familiar with smart dolls, it isn't so traumatizing. But when you see it for the first time, you're like, what? Because that's how I've been when I first saw them get dressed. And I was like, oh, God, I don't think I can come on camera and do a changing. Cause I, and I was always scared because my hands so big and heavy like my daddy. I was scared I was going to pop the doll up. Trying to do so. Okay, that goes back to that. Okay. I hope let me make sure we still recording. Yep. We are so. I'm getting down to the end. Did he say something from Stan Thrift that I can't remember? And this is from Shamara. And this one came all the way from Canada. From um, Yasmin Wombo. But her name of her shop is uh i think it's called shana run i think s e g each oh i can't even understand my own writing let me see if she got a, a card in here if not i will link this below um because she did an awesome job it's run let me see s h i think i think that's an e i got each m U R E N D J D on um Etsy. But either way, go. I'll make sure I link her shop below. Um, for some reason, there was another. Okay, we can start with this dress here. She gave me a free gift, and it's this um dress here. And everything can package really nice. 
But I saw somebody else got something from her and she gave them a free gift too. But, oh goodness, how do I get in here now? I got it open. There's something that's sticking to each other. Oh goodness. Okay. Okay, I got it. Oh, look at you got a little mini dress. And that could be like one of them body con dresses because that could really be fitting there and shapely. Oh, that could really show her shape up nice. With the owls and it's cream with the um teals, purples, and pink. That's pretty. And I like how she packaged her stuff. And this was a custom. I she had the skirts for sale. But I asked her, could she make, if she, because she had, I had it in my buggy for so long and somebody bought it. So then I wrote her and asked her, do she have any more money? I mean, more material left like this here that she can make me a skirt. And, um, and it's cute. It has the, this, this little, um, skirt, mini skirt underneath. And it's like that stretch bodycon material. And then you got the sheer on top. And then I told her I wanted a, uh, a flare wrap shirt to match it. And this became packaged like that. And this is the top to go to that shirt. Chris over top with the big veil sleeves. She also made this top with just the straight sleeves, but you know me, I like the dramatic effect at the end, so I love this. And she can wear this with her, um, she got some black heels, but I might need to get her a pair of nude pumps as well, because nudes can go with anything. I always tell everybody, if you don't have no other color, even with your rebounds, if you, you got a rebound girl, you need a white, a black and a pink shoe. And they can and, and if you don't put no other color shoes on your BB, you got those. They can pretty much go with anything. Black, white, and pink. But for adults, I think all adults need a pair of nude pumps. And when I say nude, they got all different kind of nudes to match your skin tones and stuff like that. But nudes can go with just about anything. I am going to, I might go online and look for that tonight, a pair of nude pants. But she, in the meantime, she got a pair of black patent leather she can wear with this. Because you got the black intricate designs in the lace to on the bottom. And this trim here is so thick to, it looks almost like a black velvet, but it's not. But it's really, then it has the scallop bottom. I don't know if y'all can see that on against my hand. It's really, really pretty. And like I say, she does a really, really good job. The shipping didn't take long. And she got a lot of nice and expensive things in her shop. And because the doll hobby can be as expensive as you want it to be. Because you don't have, just like I, with my, even with my um, Reborn dolls, with their Christmas clothes every year, I always leave the tags on their Christmas clothes to show people that you could dress your dolls for every holiday, but it doesn't have to cost you an arm and a leg to do so. Because everybody, I don't want to go out there and spend, my once a month job, you can get a beautiful dress for your doll under $5. But that's why I do that. And of course, y'all saw her Christmas set she had on on Christmas um, Day, which was the um, her little wrap dress with the bell sleeves, with the fur, the hat, and the little jingle bell um, neck bracelet, choker bracelet, which I didn't know that bell actually worked into the snow. <laughs> Taking it out this pack. I, I didn't even know that thing was making noise into the snow. But I keep everything in the original packs to keep up with it. <sighs> I 
and these shoes came from Sophie Doll Paradise as well. And Aunt Shauna told me about these when these were on sale. And these, the light blue. Light blue. And the hot pink. And that shop is on Etsy. And then Dee Dee House of Dolls gifted her the yellow and the soft pink. These yellow ones here, which I don't know where the pink ones went to. Oh, I had the pink ones on her Christmas, so you probably in one of them other envelopes. I mean, yeah, with all her other shoes on. So my niece man put the pink ones on it. That's right. That's from um, Dee Dee's House of Doll. This one of the little brushes I bought. For her is the my life um brush but i think you got the nice um wire bristles and it's the same kind of brush that i use for my um you know that this, this is how weight brushes are made and you can buy these from walmart and i buy this to keep them weights of her team this was her other um sleeping bag and when i originally bought this i bought it for the fuzzy slippers and the little um, eyebrow, I mean not the eyebrow, the little sleep mask, so you, um, don't act disturbed. And then there's a little roll out sleeping bag. And this too came from, um, oh goodness, I'm not rolling this little thing out. And you can tote it like this here. This came from Walmart. And this is also another My Life, you know, like for those American girl size dolls. They got this print and I believe they got the red and white and black hello kitty print but like i said she also got the one that came with her suitcase set what is that? that i showed in the previous video so that's why i say if her cousin comes down and we do a slumber party we don't even have to um because remember she got this little tote bag and this one too got a sleeping bag in it and I got this one from the Once Upon a Child. And her sleeping bag ties up in her little gym bag. And here she has another sleeping bag. So she got two. So if somebody comes spend the night with her, or uh, we go out of town. So one of my other sisters in the community who has a smart doll, and, they ha and the girls have a slumber party, they don't have to worry about having a sleeping bag. Because we got two we can bring with us. So she can have one, and then one of her cousins can have one to sleep in. So, we got you covered there. But we will be doing some type of traveling, hopefully next year, 2021. And we leave. That might be it for this particular haul here. I hope y'all, oh no, wait a minute. I got a couple of more things I want to show you. So just some little miscellaneous items. Um, I have two containers. Hold on one second. I hope this video ain't that long. Hold on one. Okay, I got these two containers. And these has the, um, the unicorn and stuff all over it. And these are some other things that I had got for her. For her and her room. These are little Uggs boots. She got the um, pink. She got the purple little Uggs. She got the teal Uggs. Okay. Let's put these aside. These are little, um, oh gosh. Hold up, let's take them out of the plastic. These are little hot shaped sun sheets. 
And we did the one with the pink and blue tank. With those. This her little sand timer in pink. So when she be brushing her little teats and stuff. Uh, some of these things in here is for her room. So when I do her room. This her own little personal hand sanitizer. With the pink. I'm telling when you go out and people want to touch you, they you will hand them your hand sanitizer and tell them to sanitize their hand before they be touching up on you. This is one of her little puppy toys. This is actually a lip balm, but like I said, some of the lip balms are so cute. And I found this at the register in Walmart, but this is a little cactus plant that she can set up on her little dresser. When we get her bedroom straight, these are a couple of her little plants that came in these little glassware. And I found these at, these at Walgreens. And this is her little unicorn Bluetooth speaker that sits up on her dresser so she can play her music. And we got this, if I'm not mistaken, I think this... I don't know if I get this from Ross, Dee Dee's, or Burlington or one of them. I'm not sure. And then she got some squishy little um, unicorn pets, little polo pets. And these are the little free things that they give you for the uh, when you order stuff from overseas, these little pops. But these are like, could be her throw pillows on her bed when I finish her bed up. Okay, that, let me put all these back. And like I said, the rest of these things are things that I'm doing to get her bed and stuff together. So that, let me see if I still got it in frame. Yep. Sorry, I got to keep jumping up and down, but keep mixing up so much. Now this ain't... This is actually, and she's not doing here no more from from what I heard. But this, when I tell you this lady here makes, this was Le'Veon Moore here. And she used to sell the prettiest more hair. Since I got it in here, I, I'll, I'll show it. But that was her information. But I, somebody told me they don't think she's selling anymore. But, um... I'll just pull, oh, I got one already open to show you how pretty the hair is. But I'm sure glad I buy up a lot when I did. But you see how rich and pretty that is? And that's the um, cocoa brown that she had. But I got um, some of all the colors. And I thank God I, when I had my little change, I would buy, you know, purchase mine because that was some beautiful 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 here and I, I need to get in touch with her I used to have her phone number that I um, got a new phone and all my numbers then transferred over so I got to check into that but anyway that what that was for all my invoices I try to keep in, in different separate envelopes. So I got to put that over there. Now, this, oh, I can get the name of the doll. Um, oh, what's the name of the doll? Is it the Kimberly doll? Kimberly? Uh, yeah, I think it's the Kimberly doll. Um, I had got her this little white hat. Went to half, and it came with the um the fur muff. Oh, that muff would go good with your boots and um your boots and outfit that you have on now. Oh, cause I've been saying the Santa outfit off would be nice, and that's the Kimberly um skater skirt. But I don't know if the skirts like this, the dress and stuff can fit her. But I wanted it for the ice skates. 
uh, for her. I know the hat fit, and like I say, the moth go cute with the boots. Matter of fact, I'm gonna keep them moth out. Put the whole that on your hand for a second. Cause I'm putting them moth on with your when you wear them boots, you can have that moth on. Then, oh, this was her squishy pumpkin. And like I said, when we went to Walmart, and I was, I already had bought her those paint pumpkins, y'all saw when I opened her up. But they had this sitting. What this thing say? I don't know. But anyway, this was sitting, you know, just by the register, and this by as a name on it, but I can't even read it. But I told the girl, I, I, I want, she said, well, I don't know if this come with a toy or what it is. Well, I said, well, I had a tech cat toy. Um, did I punch this thing back? Yeah, I had a cat toy for 99 cents. And she let me got that for, I said, can I pay 99 cents for that? Because it's just a little, um, squishy pumpkin. And she didn't know, but she said, that sounds fair. That was, that's fine. Now, Rabbity's Kimberly Duck, I know this, Kimberly or Kimberly, I don't know, but I believe it's Kimberly. Anybody can correct me underneath the video, I don't know. But since the skits fit these dolls, I just assume, well, I might as well go on. And this was a nightgown they had, which probably a fitter like a shirt, but I did it, I got it for the Baron shoes. The blue slides and <laughs> what's it don't tell me i got another um sure enough y'all another sleeping bag oh lord i got three sleeping bag sets so once again like i said sure cousins now we do a sleepover during the doll show time or something nobody got to bring a sleeping bag at the rate i'm going <laughs> look, at, look like i'm doing a collection of sleeping bags oh cryo Leave it to me, oh Earl. And all of them got the cute little tie downs and things, so that's neat. And like I said, that one had. And if you don't um, fit her, you know she got a little sister coming. It can go on her. So either way, do we can modify to fit one of them. And when I originally ordered these things, because I knew. I was getting more than one smart doll. I knew I still was going to get Oceana. So, I actually, um, got me the, um, two sets of the skates. I ordered two sets of skates because I wanted two smart dolls. So, I ordered two sets of the skates. But, um, And this was the out the little skit outfit that actually came on the doll when these dolls were made. The Kimberly doll was made. And it was the little shorts and the little top. And and the socks. Yeah, and the socks. So she'll have that little set she can put on with her skits. But I gotta contact her auntie Dee Dee because Dee Dee did some ski has seen her a pair of skis. And um she already had the palms and all that on it for her for me, which I do like them. And I don't might ask you if I can take that one with the palm. And oh, this is one of my stickers from the other lady um package. Put my stickers back. And this was another thing that came with that doll. And I think this came, this was the, um, the little roll that came with the, um, Kimberly doll. And it was the brush, the headband, and some ribbons and rollers to roll up the waist. So I thought that was cute. And I said, well, I'll get this set so she could have these pieces here. Okay, Kimberly, that's the name of the dog, because the name is on the back of the thing. K-I-M-B-E-R-L-Y. And but 
I had these things here as well. So now I think I am officially finished. Because originally I bought these containers to start keeping her things up in. So that I can keep everything together. All a bunch of little pieces. But once I um, get her closet in bed and all that stuff together we'll come back on and show those things at a later date well you can keep the little puppy out this here can go in here see anything else i don't think nothing else go in there and these containers i bought they have um the unicorn and i don't know if they still got them because i bought these since this summer, um, they had the unicorn and they also had the mermaid. And then I, when I thought about my sister who liked the mermaid, I went back to get her the mermaid one and it was gone. And I didn't see any more of the unicorn one because I wanted some more for myself. But I don't know if they discontinued them or they just was out of stock. But I might try to get back over to Hobby Lobby um, this week. Well, not this week. Next week because also... For those who've been asking, Marsha from the trendy dollar store that I buy all my baby hairbands and bowls and ribbons from, and y'all know I've done several um, haul videos and I've done several videos from her store. I just want to inform you guys, she is back open and everything in the store, I believe is a dollar. It's called Trendy Dollar. And, um... No, I think she got some things over a dollar. Yeah, she got things over a dollar. Because I think the sign sheets cost a little bit more and stuff. But either way, go. I just want to let you guys know that she's back open. I would try to get over there um, the first of the year next. Um, probably not this week. Like I said, I got family down now. But hopefully next week, I'll get over there. I'll do a video showing all the stuff that she have. Because there was a couple of people that contacted me. They know who they are. And I told them that um, I can get this stuff for them because I promised them a while back. But the store been closed down ever since this COVID thing. But she called me some weeks ago and tell me she's now officially back open. So I just haven't had the time to get over there. And like I said, I got family down right now. Um, and today, uh, to, was Christmas Eve? No, New Year's Eve. So it wouldn't be until after the new year. I'll get over there and do a video. So look forward to that video. For those who may be new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that bell so that you can be notified. If y'all love this haul, please give me a thumbs up to let me know that you enjoyed the videos and the footage and stuff that I put out. Um, feel free to comment down below this video. And like I say, for those who might have smart dolls or Thinking about getting a smart dog. Come along, my friends, come along. Get a boy. Let's ride this train. Because I'm going to tell y'all, I I didn't think I would have liked this doll as much as I am. But as y'all can see from these haul videos that I've been showing in lately, I am in love with my smart dog. And I mean, like I say, she put me in mind of a mini me. And I will be loving vicariously to this doll here and putting her in a, and all kind of things. And as y'all can see already, she changes her wigs according to her outfits, just like your mama. So with that being said, y'all will be seeing all different kind of changes on this particular doll here. And um, oh, as a matter of fact, she do have she she do have some new wigs, but I'll see that for another video. Or y'all will see her when she changed her clothes. She'll probably have it on. But, um, I just love her little hand, um, my thing. I love her jewelry, which I do need to get that, um, bracelet turned around with her name on it. And the same bracelet that she have, the lady also sell the choker necklace, um, but you can get your doll name on it as well. And, but I've been looking at this particular necklace with the leaves on it. For the longest of time, and a, a lady showed uh, her doll with the um, leaf earrings that she made for her Volk doll. And um, and I contacted her because I don't mind getting some earrings. I don't know how to pierce the ears, though. But I know everybody else been using the magnet earrings. 
But I think I want her ears pierced. I'm going to figure it out. But anyway, um, if I can. But anyway, but I think the Vox, because they got the elf ears, it, it sticks out a little bit longer. You know, the ears stick out a little bit further than, and I might have to get her some elf ears and dangling earrings from that. Who knows? But anyway, um, I just wanted to come on and show y'all this lovely outfit attire that she has on once again from Auntie Shauna's Life Low Moments and show y'all um other different vendors that y'all can purchase things for your smart doll from. Once again, it's your girl Earl. This is my smart doll. She is the Journey Classic Scout. Her name is Eileen and that ring that name derived from my mom's first name and maiden name. Her name is Iris Langard. But due to the fact that two of my sisters in the community already named their dolls after my mama Iris, I decided to give her mama initial for mama first name and half of mama maiden name. And that's how she came out with the name I Ling. And we call her Ling for short. And when I thought about it, I said, because Ling sound like a can from over there in Japan. And then I just think it just suits her. And it, I just don't see no but that's an island is a name that I just don't see throwing around all the time. Cause y'all know I come most of my dolls from Reborn's um silicones, they most of them are all named all my dolls are named after somebody that has some kind of impact on my life. But anyway. And that's how I came up with all my dolls name. And I like old family names. But anyway, this your girl Earl Eiling, and as always, thanks for watching.